My name is Denise Saylor and I'm the instructor for the nursing assistant class. We get a fair amount of single parents who come through who are looking to make more money to support their families. Uh, we get a fair amount of younger people who are coming through and use the nursing assistant course as a prerequisite for either an LPN or an RN or, or um, a nursing course of some sort. And so what we want to do is to give them as much of a feel of what it's like for the resident as possible. Basically, we are put into place as a resident so that we can then, as we're in the community lab and in whatever profession we decide to go into, we can then understand what it's like to get into an area like we did last week with a wheelchair, figure out what it's like to be blind so we can actually help somebody when we're walking down the hallway. Because like when we're blindfolded, you can't see the normal things you see around you. And you just see like a flash of here, a flash of there, and then it's just, kind of on it. Here you go. <laughs> and I will be a mouth breather. All of you line up, you can hear what's going on, but you don't have a clue <laughs> really what's going on. Um, and it was leading us through the buildings, telling us to do specific things like find a wall, touch it, find a seat, have them sit down, and it's really disorienting. So if you're walking down the hallway and you're t you know, telling them a bit about what they're seeing and what they're hearing, it puts the resident much more at ease, um, gives them a lot more trust in you as um, a person who's being their guide. But most important, it's just to get a feel for the residents that you're working with. Um, to kind of put yourself in their shoes. I like work with people. I like help people. And uh, this class helped me start talking with client and like we'll be feeling same like client understand this feeling. I want other people, other people in the different care settings to feel comfortable and feel like they're still cared about and they're still people. So that's the reason why I want to become an NA. It's the best way to do it because it's the best way to get your foot in the door. You can always go up from there. There's a lot of facilities that are, you don't have to go back to school. They will actually do all the training with you right there in the facility. We need to be prepared as part of the medical field to supply good quality, empathetic, highly trained nursing assistants to assist the nurses and the doctors with the care of, of these residents. Mrs. Saylor is actually quite wonderful. She's very kind and it helps that she's been in the profession before. We have a really good teacher who very good explain, you know. I like this. They give you so much information, but they do it in a way that you can understand it and you can pick it up pretty easy. One of the things I say to my crew the first day and the last day as they graduate, um, to remember that you're working with people. <laughs>